Welcome to this discussion on the Snapdragon LVM compiler toolchain, which is a version of the LVM compiler that is optimized for working with Snapdragon CPUs. If you are a developer and want to compile C, C++ code for Windows or Snapdragon, in this video, you will find out why the Snapdragon LVM compiler toolchain is an exceptional tool to help you do the job. I am Zhao Shi, a compiler engineer at Qualcomm for over 10 years. Today, I'm here to present the key features and optimizations of the Snapdragon LVM compiler, along with a demonstration of how to set up the tool. Working with this optimized toolchain, you can expect to see performance gains in the applications you develop. This may include applications such as audio, video, encoder, decoder, and image processing application, as well as other applications. You may be asking yourself, what the Snapdragon LVM is exactly? The Snapdragon LVM is based on the open source community LVM and is a full C, C++ compiler. It inherits all the front end and language syntax of upstream LVM. Furthermore, it is fully compatible with upstream LLVM on warnings and is supported for pragmas and attributes. Additionally, it adopts all the security features such as sanitizers and code hygiene features from the upstream LLVM. LLVM is a popular open source compiler that supports a large number of targets. It is widely used and deployed in many software stack and frameworks. There's a large set of developers behind LLVM. So what is special about Snapdragon LLVM? Snapdragon LLVM code generation and optimizations are tuned for Snapdragon software and workloads. It includes several performance optimizations, such as polyhedral-based auto-vectorize to optimize loops. One benefit of using the Snapdragon LLVM instead of the upstream LLVM is that new features and optimizations that help development on Snapdragon processors generally are released as part of Snapdragon LLVM before they become updates to the general upstream LLVM. For instance, features such as link time optimization or LTO and profile-guided optimization or PGO enablement for ARM64 have been made available to Snapdragon customers first through the Snapdragon 2 chain before being upstreamed. Snapdragon LLVM has a different LTO workflow than the upstream LLVM. This workflow is specifically tuned for Snapdragon CPU workloads. Other features that have originated in Snapdragon LLVM but have since been upstreamed include C++ exception handling and the structure exception handling. The long-term plan is to upstream all the advanced features that are initially offered as part of the Snapdragon LLVM. It takes a long time to upstream complex features, and we want to continue supporting our customers during the process with initial code optimization. However, we also want to upstream these features and capabilities once feasible to do so so we can stay close to the open source LLVM codebase. This will help align with the open nature of the LLVM codebase as well. Now you have an idea of how you can bring your compiler performance to new levels when developing for Windows or Snapdragon. I will walk you through the downloading and installation process for the Snapdragon LVM toolchain. First, we will download the toolchain, which is available through the Qualcomm Package Manager framework. Please visit QPM homepage. The link is in the description. Before you download the toolchain, you will need to create a Qualcomm ID if you don't already have one. You can go to sign up here to create one. Then you can log in with your Qualcomm ID and download the Qualcomm Package Manager. Once you are in QPM, click Choose and search for LVM. Look for Snapdragon LVM toolchain for ARM technology. Yeah. 
install Windows ARM64 version of Snapdragon Alvia. Once you have completed downloading the Snapdragon Alvia, you will need to set it up. Our VM for Windows on Snapdragon requires the Microsoft Visual Studio 2022 to be downloaded and installed. Please get it from the Visual Studio homepage. The link is in the description. We recommended community or professional preview version, and you must install all components needed to support ARM64. In Workloads tab of Visual Studio Installer, select Desktop Development of C, C++. In Individual Components tab, search and select the item show on the screen. We recommend installing the newest version of Windows 10 and Windows 11 SDKs. Specific versions can be added if required. We also recommend that you do not install Clown C++ compiler for Windows to avoid confusion. This version is now Snapdragon Alvia. Now that we have installed and set up both Snapdragon Alvia and Visual Studio, I will walk you through getting started with Snapdragon Alvia. To enable Microsoft VSOFT C++ or MSVC and the Snapdragon LVM in command line interface, run the following command at the command prompt to set up the MSVC environment. Then, add Snapdragon LVM to the path. You can use where clown cl or clown cl dash dash version to check that Snapdragon LVM is now ready for use. To build a simple hello world.
you may wonder what the difference between Cloud and Cloud CL is. Cloud CL is a Microsoft Visual C, C++ compiler, or CL.exe compatible driver of Cloud. It accepts CL.exe flex, whereas Cloud tries to be compatible with GCC, the GNU compiler collection. You can find more information about Cloud CL in the user menu. You can find the link in the description. As you are getting started with Snapdragon L Web, you may want to know how to use GCC Flex with Cloud CL or at Linker Flex. Let's look at the following example. In this example, dash O3 is passed to Cloud and slash stack 0x10000 is passed to the Linker. If you prefer to use Visual Studio graphical user interface, you can create a file named directory.build.props in your Visual Studio project folder. In this file, you will need to specify the installation path and the version of Snapdragon LVM. You can also check that your project is using the correct version of Snapdragon LLVM in Project Property page in Visual Studio. Now that we have highlighted some of the benefits of working with the Snapdragon LVM toolchain, and we have explored the initial setup of the compiler, you are ready to take your optimizations for development on Snapdragon processors to new heights. In addition to the special features and optimizations that this compiler will offer your projects, Snapdragon LVM also have a dedicated customer support team to address compiler issues. This will help you troubleshoot and jump over obstacles that you face as you begin your journey using the toolchain. In this video, you have learned how Snapdragon LVM can be a great benefit in your development process. You have also seen an overview of the installation and setup process of, to get started. And we have highlighted a few details about using Cloud CL. I am certain that you will find this toolchain invaluable to your development efforts when compiling your code for Windows on Snapdragon. Please visit the link on the screen for more resources and look out for more videos that will help you continue your development journey on Snapdragon platform.